everyone, Ms. Patsy here at Castillo Innovation Lab. Today we will be studying the second grade science book, Pebbles, Sand, and Silt, Investigation 1, First Rocks, Parts 3 and 5, Sorting. Question, how many ways can rocks be sorted? Let's find out. Today we are going to continue to work as geologists by studying rocks, their properties, and looking for patterns. Properties are things that we observe about objects by seeing them or feeling them. Here's a list of 21 rock properties in which rocks can be sorted. For this investigation, we will be using two types of sorting mats, one with circles and one with bars. I will place a link for both of these in the description of this video. So let's get started. For part three of this investigation, the focus question is, how are river rocks the same? So let's take a look at our river rocks. What similarities do you see? How can we sort them? We can sort them by size, maybe by shapes, or by color. If you were to sort them, what property would you use? For part five of our investigation, the focus question is, how many ways can rocks be sorted? So for that question, I have a container of rocks of many different colors. I think this is iron pyrite. Here's some pink granite. This looks like quartz. This also looks like granite. This looks like sandstone. And this is mica. another piece of quartz and we can just sort our rocks by colors and it's nice when we have lots of different colors of rocks this looks like some sort of a lava rock we have more more types of rock than we have circles this this is very light, this and porous. This looks like pumice, feels like pumice. It's another mica. And this looks like another iron pyrite, which is uh, also called fool's gold. This kind of looks like gold. We can use either sorting mat to sort by type, colors, or size, but we can use sorting mat too to form a bar graph of our rocks to compare quantities of each type of rock. When you look at all of these rocks, what do you notice? I notice all the colors. What makes rocks so colorful? Let's find out. Colorful rocks. What are these colorful objects? They are minerals. There are many different kinds of minerals. Minerals come in lots of different colors. Rocks are made out of minerals. 
That's why rocks can be so many different colors. This rock is made of different minerals. Can you see them? Look for the black mineral. Look for the pink mineral. Look for the gray mineral. These are the minerals in this rock. This rock is called pink granite. Let's take a closer look at this pink granite. How many different kinds of minerals can you see in it? A mineral is a solid inorganic substance that occurs naturally. They have a structure that makes them look like they're made out of crystals. Each color is a different mineral. The pink color is usually feldspar. The clear or grayish mineral is quartz. The black mineral is biotite or black mica. Granite comes in many different colors. And granite is a type of igneous rock, which means that it was formed from lava or magma. So go outside and find some pretty rocks and sort them on your sorting mats. I hope you enjoyed our rock sorting activities and learning about colorful rocks. Until next time, have a great day.